you are the man. Yes, sir. You hey, are let's the see if we got enough fuel to burn this thing down. When we lost Dale Earnhardt in the first of 2001, they retired the number three. Richard Childress said we'd only bring it back for family. Good job, Austin. Love you, buddy. Love you. Hell, hell of a job, man. That's Pawpaw. Paw. Yeah, That's all you guys. That Thank is you. Grandpa Richard Childress congratulating Austin Dillon taking the checkered flag as tonight's Sunoco fueling victory. When Richard said that, we assumed a member of the Earnhardt family, but then his grandsons, Austin and Todd, wanted to be racers. Austin had worn the number three since Little League, and on every race car he'd ever driven, and Richard Childress said, yes, let's put the three back on the car for Austin, and now he takes it to hallowed ground. Victory lane at Charlotte Motor Speedway. Although I think they're going to have to push it there. <laughs> I, don't, I wouldn't really worry about that. He spun the tires for about 20 feet, <laughs> and then it ran out. <laughs> David Pearson went to victory lane in car number three in the 600. So did Buddy Baker. So did Dale Earnhardt for Richard Childress, and now Richard's grandson, Austin Dillon, will join that and this illustrious group who score their first career Cup Series win on Stock Car Racing's longest night.